This tutorial will show you a quick view of how to share items from one Google Docs account to another Google Docs account. So congratulations on those of you who have successfully been able to log in to your new IU13 Google Apps for Education account. So remember to log in, you simply go to Google and you click on sign in. When you click on sign in, Google has the ability to remember all of the different usernames and passwords that you may, or usernames at least, that you have of all your different accounts. So if your IU13 account isn't listed in here, this is where you would click on add account to get into that particular account. So I'm going to click on a former Google account that I had and click on sign in. And now that I'm in my Google Apps account, I can click on these little dots to get to the different apps. So in this case, I want to click to get to the drive. The drive is where all of my Google Docs information is, so all my files, my documents, my spreadsheets, and everything. So in my drive here, I have a whole bunch of different folders set up. You may have folders in there, or you may just have lists of files like this. They have a variety of files. On any one of these, you can take these folders and you can come over and just right click on the folder itself and click on share. When you click on share, all the contents in that folder, no matter what's in there, everything that I have in there now is going to share over to where I'm designating right now. So I'm going to share it with my new IU13 Google Apps for Education account. So you see I'm just sharing it to my IU13 email address. I can add a message here if I want to see a message come through my email. And here I want to make sure that I can edit it so that I'm sharing it with my new account and I'm giving me editable rights to it and click send. The moment that I do that it's automatically shared over to that account. So I can take anything in here that I have all these folders and I can go to every single one of these folders and I can again right click on it, click share, enter my IU13 email address, make sure I can edit it and click send. So everything that I have in this folder right now, if I click on this folder, everything that's in that folder is going to be shared. So this is the quickest way. If you don't have folders set up, you can click over here for new. You can choose folder. You might want to put old Google Docs files and click create. And when you do that, I would recommend that you would drag everything in there. So if you do your drop down for my drive and you go to that folder that I just created, old Google Docs files, I can then, I have that folder open and I can use that folder. So anything that I have recent, I can click on and I can just drag, just drag one after another to this file. So I can take this test here and I can just drag it in there. So I can just drag, 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 drag anything that I want in there. And then I can come over to this folder. And again, I can right click over here as well, just like I could in here. Click on share, enter my IU13 email address and click send and it automatically then is going to send over to my new IU13 uh, Google Apps account. So that's about the quickest way to be able to get all of your files moving from your personal account to your new IU13 account. So just to show you what that's going to look like now, if I come over to my account here and I sign out and I go to my new IU13 account. So I already have it in here because I've signed in before. If you don't, you just click Add Account. So here I'm clicking on my new account, making sure that my new IU13 password is in there. And when I click Login, it comes to this account information. I'm going to go back to these dots here, go to the drive. Here I see that I'm on the IU13 account because IU13, the IU13 logo shows up there. Now this is what I want to do. I want to click on incoming. Incoming will show me everything that I have shared just recently. So notice this other file, these files came in here, these folders that just came in. In order to add them to my drive, to get them into my Google Ads for Ed, yes, I've shared them. But what I want to do is come over here, see where these icons pop up. I want to click on the icon add to my drive. 
and automatically now it's in my drive. I can do that with this file as well. Click Add to my drive and it automatically now is in my drive. So if I come over here to look at my drive and do the drop down, I can scroll up and down there and see, oh, there are my old Google Docs files. So I can click on that and I can see every single file that I have in there. So I have 